Hey, 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 what's up, everybody? What's up? Anthony Morrison here. Welcome to tonight's Success Connection. Hopefully, all of you are having a phenomenal, phenomenal uh, day and have had a phenomenal week. Um, you know, that's the biggest, biggest and most important thing to me is that everybody has a wonderful, wonderful week. If you can, do me a favor. Just go right here to our Facebook group and join the Facebook group at go.dsc.com forward slash group. And then, of course, it would be ideal if you would post in there right now and let everybody know you are live on the Success Connection. Uh, Nick, let's go ahead and give out two people $50 uh, for, uh, for making that post. So we'll randomly select two of you and give $50 away. Uh, just for making the post there in the Facebook group. Let everybody know you are live on the Success Connection, right? So do that for me now. And then, of course, if you are not following me on YouTube, I highly suggest, you know, that you do. Uh, this is a place where, you know, we spend a lot of time putting, you know, just free content, trainings and stuff like that up, uh, do some cool giveaways and things like that. So make sure that you are following us on YouTube, right? Uh, and then, of course, uh, make sure that uh, you are part of our Facebook group and have made all of the uh, uh, made all the necessary posts to possibly win uh, some of the cash prizes. How many of you have had a good week this week? Just give me a big yes in the chat box if you've had a good week. Very cool. Um, very cool. Awesome. Very cool. I see lots and lots of people uh, that are saying, I've had a great week. I've had a great week. I've had a great week. How many of you have worked on your business this week? Huh? Yeah. I see lots of people saying yes. That's good. Well, anyway, um, listen, I want to, uh, I've got some stuff. Let me get my webcam on here. Hold on. There we go. Um, so I've got some stuff to share with you tonight. I, I've, all, I've built you a, a new funnel page that I'm going to be giving to you. Um, but I want to take a second to, uh, well, first let's uh, let's address all of you that are new. If you're new to the Success Connection, uh, welcome and thank you for being here. Um, hopefully you find this a, to be a great place and a place that you are happy to spend every Thursday night. We're happy to have you, that's for sure. Um, we love uh, we love what we do. We love teaching and. Uh, Ultimately, we love to uh, we love to 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 inspire, you know, and if you enjoy that, you'll enjoy the success connection because that's what we do. Um, so if you're new, congratulations. Thanks for being here. Um, also, just want to let you know that uh, the success connection is not a continuation of any course training. So if you've got partner with Anthony, our ambassador program, you know, any number of things. Right. Um, do not uh, expect for us to be continuing those trainings here. Those are great trainings or courses, um, and they have their own little path, right? Uh, the Success Connection, I put this together about seven years ago, and it was really just designed to take all of my students, bring them all to one place, and say, hey, let's learn something cool. Let's learn something new. Let's do something, right? We do a lot of stuff for you. We do a lot of stuff with you, right? Um, our goal is always to show you how it's done, but also do enough of it for you that you can go on and get started while you're learning, right? So it's, um, I would say it's a different environment than maybe what you're used to, um, but hopefully you find it uh, valuable and enjoy it and you continue to show up each and every week. Um, with that said, uh, last week we obviously had uh, what was uh, very emotional for me. I know a lot of you uh, probably as well with the uh, passing of one of our uh, one of our members and uh, and I ask you guys to support, you know, support her work. Uh, her name was Cece. Um, support her work. And so many of you purchased books on Amazon, like so many of you purchased her children's books on Amazon and you posted in the Facebook group that. I'm just, uh, God, 
you know, sometimes I'm just blown away by the, uh, by the impact we can make um, as a community, right? Um, you know, when you start thinking about downstream, how that, how that looks, you know, all those children's books, her message, her words, you know, what she wanted to, to share with, with kids around the world. And now there's so many children that will be sitting at home with their parents, flicking the pages of those books that she wrote. And, um, and I hope she could see down and, uh, and, and, and see all these, just all these kids that are, are going to be impacted by, uh, by her work, you know, um, and thank all of you for, uh, for purchasing those books and and uh, and supporting, uh, you know, a fellow, you know, Success Connection member, um, you know, that's what I built this place for was for connecting, uh, you know, so that that we would feel like we should support each other, not tear each other down, so that you have a safe place to go each Thursday once a week, you know to get away from maybe the naysayers in your family or your friends, maybe even your coworkers, right? That all tell you, you can't do this and this internet thing is stupid and you're never gonna make any money and all that stuff. Um, you know, all the people that try to bring you down, you now have this other community uh, of people that do nothing but bring you up, right? And I'm just so, proud to have been a part of creating such an awesome place that um that i you know that that i could just say hey you know go buy these children's books and let's support her and then just like tons and tons of people buying these books and not buying one buying four or five six seven eight right um just amazing um i am going to purchase uh like i said five thousand dollars worth of these books and I'm going to give them away here locally um, to underprivileged kids, kids that may not otherwise, you know, get, you know, get a book and um, just try to make, you know, uh, continue to allow what CC did uh, and the work she did uh, make an impact, you know, because that's, that's really what it's all about. It's about impacting people, you know, and I think that's, um, you know, that's, that's really the message that I want to, uh, that I want to share with you tonight before we get started on, uh, on our training. It's, is, is the impact that you can have on, on a person. I've always told you guys that words matter, right? You know, I've always said words matter, words matter. You've heard me say this all the time. I'm going to tell you a quick story. I don't talk too much about my, um, when I got started online, right? Um, I used to talk about my story all the time, and then the further we got away from the start date of my journey to success online, uh, the less and less I I talk about it, right? Um, when I got started online, I taught my, yeah, I started making money, okay? Um, it was probably 22, 23, and it was in my second year of college. I started making some money on the internet and the first thing I did, I had always wanted a Dodge Viper. And so I asked my dad, I'm like, dad, I've made all this money. Could I buy myself a Viper? And he said, absolutely, son, you work your butt off. You, you should buy yourself a Viper. So I bought a refurbished, uh, like what is it? The refurbished title Viper like a 1996, right? And I drove this Viper to college. It was blue with white stripes. It only cost 30 grand. So it was, it, it looked like a hundred thousand dollar car, but it cost me 30 grand. And everybody started paying attention to me, right? Because that's what happens when you make a lot of money. Everybody starts paying attention to you. And my college roommate or my college buddy, he came up, he came to me and he said, listen, I want to do that. He's like, I want to learn, you know? And 
I said, okay, I'm going to teach you. So I started teaching him how to do what I was doing. It's interesting because he worked at his dad's suit store. He was not the smartest kid in class. Neither was I for that matter, right? We were both trying to go, to, he was trying to go to uh, optometry school and I wanted to go to medical school. So we're in the same classes. Neither of us were the smartest ones, right? And so when I taught him this, he was working in his dad's suit store. He was making, you know, eight bucks an hour selling ties, you know, after class. And I said, Justin, I'm going to show you how to do this and you're going to make a lot of money. But I want you to save your money. I don't want you to buy boats and cars and all these things. Now, mind you, I just bought a car, right? Um, I said, I want you to save your money. And I want you to save that money so that you can pay for your own home one day. And, th and I think the reason that, that was so like ingrained in my brain is my parents almost lost their home. They legitimately almost lost their house, right? Uh, now, by the time I bought the Viper, I'd made enough money to pay off their house, right? So there was no more worries. But but for me, it was all like, oh my gosh, you could make all this money in your lifetime and then still lose your home in your mid-60s. That's where my parents were. You know, that was that was the situation. So I, I told Justin, like, don't waste your money, save your money. So fast forward five years. You know, we're out of college. He's back where, you know, where where he you know, live where he came from. I'm running around the country doing seminars and I wanted to film a, a testimonial with Justin. I, I said, Hey, I'm going to come visit you. I want to film a, sit down and film a video with you about how you got started. You know, I taught you and you know, I'm proud of you, you know, all these things. And he said, okay, meet me at my house. He gave me his house address. I show up and it's, it's just being framed. It's like just framing of a house. I'm like, what is this? You know? And he said, man, this is my new house. My wife and I are expecting a kid and I just paid cash for this home, like our forever home. I paid cash for it. And I looked at him, I said, man, how did, how did you pay cash for it? You know? Um, because he wasn't making 200, $300,000 a month. Right. I said, how did you make pay cash for this? He said, man, you remember when you told me not to buy jet skis and boats and to save my money so that I could pay for my, you know, I could secure my family home. And I was kind of like racking my brain like, yeah, I remember, but I didn't really remember. Right. And he said, I listened and I saved every penny that I ever made from my online business. And I was able to pay cash for our dream home. And now my family will never have to worry about losing our home. Man, that hit me like a ton of bricks because when I was when I was 22, 23, I was giving good advice. I mean, at least I think I was, you know. But I never realized how much of an impact words can have on someone's life. Those few little words that I said when I said, don't waste your money, don't blow it on boats and, and, and cars and jet skis and all these things. I said, save your money so that you can pay cash for a house so that you never have to go through what my dad's going through in his sixties, getting ready to lose his house unless I could figure it out how to, you know, how to make money. And to see that um, full circle five, six years later and to see that there is, there is a kid that's here whose life is completely changed, not because of just what I taught him, but because of what I told him. Words matter. I challenge all of you to use good words, to communicate, and to always realize the things that you say, they have an impact on people. Whether it's positive or negative is totally up to you, right? But they do have an impact. And sometimes you don't even see that impact. You don't even know that it happened, but it does. We see this all the time with people that bully kids in school. And then 
all of a sudden you wonder why, uh, you know, why a child lashes out or why they, they commit suicide and all these things. It's because words matter, right? I want all of you to use good words, right? Communicate well, think before you speak. And as you interact with each other in our community, be kind, right? And uplifting. Because all of those positive words that you can share with people, those positive sentences, those positives, you've got it, you know, that you can share with people. You never realize what type of an impact those can truly have on someone's life, right? And so I think it's so very important that we remember that and uh, and that we choose our words wisely, right? All right, so let's uh, let's dive into to tonight's training, right? Why don't we do that? Because I've got all kinds of good news uh, for you guys. Um, all kinds of good news. So why don't we get into the good news, right? So let's first give a little catch up to everybody <coughs> to everybody here. Okay. Um, we are currently building out a business. Let me just go back upstream here. We're building out a business that looks like this. It's a uh, it's called the affiliate selling system, and uh, it is, for lack of other ways to describe, um, the affiliate selling system is simply just a way for you to be able to make additional sales, more sales of multiple products, right? Um, people buy for different reasons. We've talked about that. They buy in different ways. Um, Marketing is all about finding the hook that's going to get someone to say yes to your product, right? Well, if you think about it, lots of companies use many different hooks to sell the same thing. And you ask yourself, why? Why does company A have seven different commercials? Why don't they just have one? Well, I guarantee you it's because all seven of those are aimed at a different demographic, a different type of person, a different, you know, a different mindset person, right? And that's the reason why, okay? We have to find messaging that will sell to everyone that may be interested in our product, not just one group of people, right? And that's the whole point of, you know, that's truly the whole point of, of of marketing in general, right? And so what we did was we started building this affiliate sales system so that we could accomplish that. Number one, we can sell to people with different messaging. We can sell to people in different ways. And then also, probably most importantly, is that we can sell people different products, not just one. So the idea that you can get multiple commissions make multiple sales is so very important. Um, I, it's just, it's like, it's hard for me to explain because I use the, the same analogy all the time and it never ceases to amaze me that, that it's like light bulb moment for people when I use it. But it would honestly be like when you start an affiliate marketing business and you are out there promoting a product, I don't care what product it is, any product, just pick a product. When you are promoting one product for one commission, you are setting yourself up for absolute failure. That's all I can say. Now, does it work sometimes? Sure. Does it most of the time fail? Yeah, it does. Why? The same reason that you don't walk into the grocery store and they only sell one product, you know? The same reason that you don't walk into a Walgreens and see one thing on the shelf. It costs money. Try to think. It costs money to get a customer in the door so you need to make sure that that customer has the highest average order value humanly possible, right? It's that simple. Because that's the only way you can win, right, in, in, in marketing. 
anyway. And so what the affiliate selling system does is it allows you to create that opportunity. It allows you the opportunity to earn multiple commissions, not just one. It allows you the opportunity to sell multiple things, not just one. And in doing that, you are able to actually win, right? And that's what this is all about. It's all about creating an opportunity for you to win. So tonight we have two assets we're giving you. We'll go through those in just a second. Um, this is the funnel, all right? So if you're looking at this, this right here in yellow up here at the top says phase one. Uh, this is traffic that comes into an opt-in page and then they get sold um, a specific product, right? So let's just take a look at that real quick. Uh, this is that opt-in page and this is that sales page, hold on, for that part of the funnel. Okay, so here it is. Put your email address in, opt in, you'll get this free report. Uh, go here, watch this video, and you can purchase that product, okay? Super simple. That's this part of the funnel right here, okay? If somebody says no, then we wanna send them some emails to get them to what we call our 24-hour closing page, right? Well, we've built that page for you too. All right, so here's the 24-hour close page. Let me just show you. And if you're new to this, we're gonna give you all these pages. All right, so here's a 24-hour close page. So check this out. They opt in, they go to the sales page, they can download their free report right here. All this is already hooked up for you, by the way. If you're new, I give you all of these pages, this whole funnel. You'll get all this in just a minute for free, okay? So don't worry about it. It's all done for you, like I said, we do it for you. All right, so then you've got the sales page here, right? Selling this product for $9.95 a month, right? If somebody does not buy, okay, they don't buy, then we wanna send a series of emails, okay? It shows two emails here to a 24 hour close page, which looks like this, where we're really just saying, hey, we're closing this thing in 24 hours, like urgent, buy now, you see what I'm saying? Now, we've already got all of this stuff. This is your Success Connection Student Center. Let me just scroll down um, and show you where this is. So your funnel pages are here, and then your emails to get people to that 24 hour page are right here, okay? So I'll give those to you in just a second. But suffice to say we have opt-in, sales page, 24 hour page. Now, part of the affiliate sales system is understanding that people buy for different reasons, okay? One is urgency. Closing in 24 hours. Buy now. Flood of new sales. The other is, hey, you missed it. We closed. You couldn't even buy this, but we've opened it back up for 48 hours to give you a second chance. Wow. That can be powerful marketing because it makes people realize I missed out, but I have a second chance. How many of you have missed out on something in life and wish you had a second chance at it? Just say yes, I can tell you I have, okay? When I was, when I was in high school, um, you guys don't know this about me unless, <clears throat> unless you read my book. Um, when I was in high school, I was really good at baseball. I know that sounds crazy because I know all of you know that I've, I'm tiny. I mean, look at my arm. I work out every day and look at it. I mean, I still look tiny, you know, just like tiny. But I was very good at baseball. I'm left-handed and I was a pitcher. And I could throw a ball really fast, right? Um, I could throw the ball fast and I was really good. And one night, uh, my brother came flying in the driveway, just boom, just flying in, jumped out of his car, came running in the house. He's like, dad, dad, help me, dad, help me. And I'm like, what, dad's not here. And I'm like, I'm here. So I come running outside and there's this truck that's pulled up in our driveway. And my parents' house had like this long, kind of a winding driveway that went up to it. It set up, okay? So it was just like a little curve and up. And they had come up in the driveway and they were chasing my brother. It was a group of kids group of guys in a big monster truck 
and they were chasing him and he was this little mustang right and so I'm like oh my gosh you know it's terrible well he waited around we just locked the doors he waited around he was supposed to take his he was taking his girlfriend home he said man i gotta get my girlfriend home i'm gonna take her and i said adrian let me get in the car with you just in case and so i got in the car with him we pulled out of our neighborhood and we made a right turn and right when we turn bright lights that truck was waiting on him they had been chasing him and they were waiting on him and much longer story short back in my younger years um much younger years i uh, i didn't like to fight but i but i but i was but i wasn't afraid of fighting and i ended up in a fight with five people and one of them took a crowbar and hit me across the face with it hit me right here severed my nerve here smashed my cheek my eye hemorrhaged came out and then and then fell back and sunk down in my face i had to uh funny thing is i didn't feel a thing i was so mad um i was still fighting with my eye hemorrhaged and uh i ended up having to have emergency surgery uh so i wouldn't lose my eye i currently have a piece of plastic underneath my eye that holds it up that's what fuse the bone back together I have no feeling in my teeth up here uh, because it severed this oculus nerve here so I have no no feeling in the top right side of my mouth I haven't since I was 18 and I lost my opportunity to play baseball I was uh, I could not heal fast enough my senior year uh, and then once I did heal doctors told me you cannot have baseballs flying back at your face at this moment or anytime soon and so i lost my chance to play baseball and if i had a second chance to do something that would possibly have changed my life you know i was like i said i was really good um gosh i would love it because I, I i was competitive i loved the sport right and i told you that long story not so that you would just i could eat up three minutes right Think about all the emotions involved in my second chance. Think about what I would be feeling if I had a second chance at baseball right now, right? Think of all of the stuff that I just told you and all the things that happened, right? When you offer somebody a second chance, it's deeper than, hey, you missed out, here's a second chance. Second chances to people have deep meaning, right? They're rooted in uh, in experiences. And so when we make a second chance offer, we want to, and I'm not saying like, it's the second chance to start a business and you're like, oh my gosh, it's life changing, right? But second chances in general, the term second chance has a somewhat emotional meaning, right? Um, it can elicit an emotional response from people because there are many things in life they wish they had a second chance at. And all of you just said yes to, or at least most of you, right? So second chances are something we can all relate to. We all have that story, right? And so when we use things that are relatable, we're able to bridge the gap because in online marketing, it's difficult for people to know who to trust. Most everybody is full of crap. It's just the truth. Most every video you watch, most every ad you see, it's people that are just full of crap. They've never done anything they're teaching and they have no intention of teaching you, right? They have every intention of selling you something that may or may not be of any value and then letting you figure it out on your own. They don't care, right? It's hard because over time, people have become jaded. People have become cynical when it comes to internet marketing, certainly education online for internet marketing, and just truly understanding what, you know, like what, <clears throat> what is actually, what is actually happening. So, um, you know, I think that the more we can bridge the gap, 
and relate to people, the more they're going to buy from us. Do you feel me? Does everybody understand that? We got to be relatable, right? We have to be human, you know? And so second chance offerings are a lot more than just, oh, you missed it, second chance. But second chance offerings do work because it taps into an emotional response that's not the same as FOMO, fear of missing out, right? It's a totally different emotional response button that we're pressing, right? And we're gonna get that feedback from the person, okay? So 48 hour, uh, basically what happens is you go to this 24 hour thing, we shut it down and then we say, wait, the page is, is gonna open back up for 48 hours. Here's your second chance, right? And that is this page right here. So we have a 48 hour reopen second chance page right second chance to do you can see 48 hour reopening and it's counting down right so we've got this second chance so we've taken people kind of on a roller coaster they can skip the line and crush it in 2022 they see a sales video they say eh maybe that's not for me they get 24 hour page and they're like oh my gosh i got fomo i can't miss out on this so they buy or they miss that email totally but then they get one about the second chance right and now they come here to buy. We've now taken people and we've kind of taken them down this path right here. See the green path all the way down. And we're right here where basically we're going to promote this page, this 48 hour page, you know, for two days. And then we close things down and we sit still, right? We sit still, okay, right here. We don't do anything else. Now, before we get to the second part of the funnel, last week I told you guys if you did your homework, okay, which was building these pages, these 24 hour and 48 hour pages, just like this, okay, I told you that I would review those and I'd pick some winners. And I want you guys to look at this. This was who did their homework uh, week one when I asked, okay? It was just a few people, right? Not a lot. I also gave every single one of them $50, right? But look at how many people did it once we started, once we really tapped into why we're here and why we need to be doing this. Look at this, like something like 40 or 50 people, you know, three times as many people did their homework. So I'm gonna buy some of these pages, all right? I'm gonna buy some of these pages from you guys um, you've created a, a 48 hour and a 24 hour page. Let's look at Jody White's. I've got a few of them. Um, obviously Jody uh, has built hers and you can see, look how good this page looks. Awesome page, right? Um, just such a, and, and even has just a great setup with the video, just everything. So this is Jody's 20, uh, 48 hour page. Let's check out Jody's 24 hour page. All right, look at that. 24 hour page, boom. So Jody's looks really good. Let's look at Bernie's page. Uh, Bernie always does some really good pages that we can buy. Okay, so look, totally different. Look, it's got animated stuff going on here, um, animated stuff going on here. Um, looks really cool. Looks totally different, but looks really good. Uh, the only thing I would say on these pages is a little bit, you know, we have too many animations, okay? It's distracting. I'm trying to watch this and listen, but I'm, but this keeps looping. I might would leave this and get rid of this, right? Um, the only criticism I would have is you just want to, uh, you know, you want to make sure that you've got like this. See, this is just one thing, right? So it's not so busy, uh, but these pages look really good really good. So hopefully you guys will give us these pages to give away to everybody because we did pay you for them last week uh, or we did pay you last week anyway. In fact, what we'll do, um, I said I was going to buy these for $100. So I'm just going to add another 50 to each of you because we're buying these from you. We did, everybody got $50 in their homework last week. You guys get another 50 uh, this week uh, because we are purchasing your page okay now i looked at a lot of these before we got on here i want to review some of them with you so you guys can see some of my logic 
So a page like this looks really good. I don't have any real criticism for, for this page. Um, the only thing I would say is that it, it's kind of like squished in, right? And also the video is pretty small, okay? You wanna kind of highlight, the, the video needs to be the star. Who is this? Dennis. Let me see if uh, Jim's, one of these had the same issue and one had with the opposite. Okay, the Jim's is one. So Jim has the video being the kind of like the star. See how big it is, okay? Um, but Jim, this, the page doesn't have, uh, like the right assets on it, right? Like, um, first of all, I would never put this kind of a, so best advice I can give all of you is don't use images to correlate to words. Like time is running out. We don't need an image of somebody looking at their watch that takes away from the time is running out kind of like headline. See what I'm saying? Because now I'm over here looking at this guy and I'm like, is that a Red Sox shirt or is that a, you know, like I'm paying attention to something that has nothing to do with anything, right? These types of things, not a good idea. Um, but having your video be the star of the show is a good idea. Um, of course, none of this is really relevant to the actual offer, which is, you know, is, is obviously important, right? Um, there's a couple more in here I wanted to show you. Let's see. Okay. I think, I think this was one that, so one of the things that I always kind of try to do just as an FYI is, do you see how, uh, was this Dennis, right? Yeah. So you see how this, when you put this up here, and then you have all of this. I want you to stop for a second. I want all of you to focus on this up here, okay? I want you to look at it. Nothing really stands out. You still have 48 hour opening, right? To get your M Insider newsletter now is the time to enroll, okay? Um, it, this is a little confusing because like this implies that this is a sentence and then this is a sentence. So you got to work on your text. But the point is, all of this kind of blends. You normally want to take your timer, okay? And you don't want that to be, if it's this high up, you want it to be off to the side or underneath your headline. You want your headline to really stand on its own, right? So move this up here, this down below it, right? Um, and then try to break this up. See how it's all the same color and it's so long and so wordy? You wanna have very, very intentional words when you are looking at your headlines, okay? Very intent. Do you see how he moved this over here? Who did this? Shane, see how Shane moved this over here? It means that it doesn't push the page down more, right? Um, <clears throat> so kind of a, a, a trick and a tactic that we do. Now, I probably wouldn't have like the logo and then this and then all this, right? Keeping it clean and simple at the top of the page is very important, okay? It's very, very important because it's what causes people, <clears throat> sorry, it's what causes people to stay on the page, right? Is when they see this, right? <clears throat> so, this is a nice job by Patricia. Um, looks like you kind of took my page through this in here, changed up some colors. So this is not a, a, a bad one um, at all. Uh, let's see what Willard's looks like. There's a few in here that I wanted to look at. Um, so like, for instance, this. This is uh, this would be like no bueno, okay? Uh, so is this Willard? Willard, thank you for trying. Thank you for doing your homework. Thank you for participating. Now, let me just give you some advice. We don't need to see seven colors on one page. Uh, we have this color yellow, this color blue, we have black, we have white, we have this color yellow, we have red, then we have this lime green, and then we have the purple that's in my video right here, we're at eight, right? And then you have this blue down here, we're at nine. Nine different colors, and if you count the white on the text and in this, 
you know, we're at 10 different colors. That's way too much. When I look at this, it looks like Legos, right? So less is more. You're, you, you want to, I love the fact the video's big, right? But you just want to create pages that have less color. A lot of times I see people making, uh, you know, making these, these pages with so many colors. And I want all of you to realize you don't have to use all the colors, right? Like for instance, look at this, okay? This uses two basic colors, okay? And that's the blue and the red, all right? White, obviously, like I said, we not really count. It's like a base, right? We have the blue and the red, all right? It's a basic page. It's a very simple page. But my eyes are drawn to this because it's the brightest color and it's kind of like the only color, right, on the page. So all of a sudden, my eyes are drawn to it. And I, I can see, oh my gosh, it's, it's gonna close down in 48 hours. Like that's a good job of color usage, right? Um, this is the same thing, it's just, uh, but do you see how this is a little messier? Because we have this red up here, we have this red over here, and we have all this orange. Do you, do you see how like, if, if a user landed on these pages, okay, how it's much cleaner and easier to see everything here than there? See what I'm saying? White backgrounds make a huge difference in conversion rates. I know it sounds crazy, and I know all of you can think I'm stupid, but I'm really not. When you do a white background, even just this one versus the black background, it's easier to see, right? Uh, there's a reason why notebook paper isn't, isn't uh, orange and black and blue, and you're not given pens that write in, in, in you know, red and, and green to use on them. Most all notebook paper's white, and then you can put any color on it, and you can see it well. It, I mean, look, my whiteboard, it's called a whiteboard. I don't even think there's an option to change the background to anything other than white, because that's what makes all of this stuff visible at, at a higher rate, right? Uh, so I think that's important. For all of you to know white backgrounds will do better for you okay um, this is good just adding in this it's a good job we got to make sure we uh, check all of our our spelling and stuff this is a good job by uh, Mary uh, let's see what Joe has going on here all right so Joe this is kind of another one of those things where I'm try trying to talk about we don't want to use all these colors I can barely read that see what I'm saying so you're all getting, I want you to all look at the difference. And what you're seeing is the creativity that comes out of different brains. And look, I suck at creativity, right? I really do. I'm no good at it. But I can tell you right now that over the years, I've just learned what converts and what doesn't, right? Um, for instance, this, this doesn't look terrible. I actually don't mind this purple. Um, I don't even mind this. You see how this is up here? So it sits on a little section, make money, make more money in 2022. Um, the only thing I probably wouldn't do is, is have this, right? Um, I would just have this button and, and that's it, right? And that would clean that up. That's Jeff. Good job for Jeff. Let's take a look at Alexis's here real quick. All right. So Alexis has one. So Alexis has, has a, I want you to look at how clean her use of color is right here and here and then here it all matches and then even right right here right uh the only thing i don't really prefer on this is this i don't like this i don't like the dark blue and then the red and then a different color blue see this all gets kind of messy i think you want to take this off okay and put a basic timer on this page you know black you know red just something like that maybe get rid of all that and it'll look much better, Alexis. I think you'll get better conversion rates out of it, which is really what I'm here to help you uh, help you do. All right, so we definitely don't want to have this in here three times. Uh, otherwise, this page kind of is the sim is sim basically just mine. That's from uh, Patty. Uh, Diana, thank you for doing your homework. Um, so I don't know what video this is, Diana, but the video is not on here. Um, it looks like maybe you're not finished with it. 
Uh, we don't want to, but see, like this is the what I'm saying. You don't want to just throw like a logo floating in space with these squared off. You know what I'm saying? Everything should be very intentional. All right. Um, if you put it on the page, it should be to increase the results of the page. For instance, uh, was this? This is Anthony Bates, right? Yeah, Anthony. Um, this background too busy, right? If you take this and you just change this background to white and you start adding all these changing these colors you get far better results right it's just too busy and too much going on um, you want your focus remember guys your focus should be on the stuff that's selling okay now here's an interesting thing this page right here now obviously you can't you shouldn't have all of this like this right you should never have a sign up button before the video so if, let's assume we took this off we move this up this is a background that you can use that isn't going to just kill your conversions because it's very basic and plain does everybody see that there's not a lot going on i still prefer white and i still think if you split test it white will win but this this type of background isn't busy so everything here is very visible right if that makes sense um that was for neville um we had some a couple others let's see braden's let's see braden's building some good stuff so so for instance braden has a very good uh a very good example of this m insider newsletter access the special reopening will close you can clearly see okay but this will close braden i would get rid of that because this isn't social media so i would get rid of this and i would get rid of this i would leave just this and then I would have this right and then what I would do is I mean I don't actually don't have a problem with some of this copy and I love this right like this is a good job um, this adds everything up shows everything takes I mean this is a good page Braden will buy this page from you let's just get rid of this and let's get rid of this okay because I want people to have options if you want to have a black background you can okay um we'll buy this from brayden for a hundred now guys when i say i'm gonna buy this i buy it and then i give all of you the pages for free so next week you'll get these pages for free all right um so this isn't uh, terrible i just think that uh maybe the use of like too much orange and purple right in in these things um it, the thing is, if you look at this, it was from Donna. Donna, great job. Thank you for doing this. Uh, let's see, Jim. Um, if you look at anybody that's doing this online, so Jim, your page, this, your video is too small, uh, but there's not much else on the page, so it wouldn't be a whole lot different than uh, probably what I originally had put forth. Um, kind of same with this. This is kind of the same uh, thing I'd already done. Plus, you're missing your buy button on here, Elizabeth. Um, when you look online at pages that convert looks like i must have clicked gems again let's look at janice um most all of them are more, look more like this right it's because that's what people will stay on right this looks great it's just it's obviously you know pretty much the same thing that uh that i already have changed a couple things but that's cool i mean at least you did your homework and you launched the page uh gordon sent me a shared funnel link so gordon i can't look at that um i think i've looked at pretty much all of these i know i looked at some the other day so like this is another thing i saw this thought it was interesting that you had this countdown timer on top of an image um interesting that you know how to do that uh but all of this up here makes this second fiddle right and when you're trying to get somebody to buy something in a 48 hour, you know, like reopen situation, you really want the attention to be right up here on this video. You don't want the attention to be pulled onto something else. You want it to be boom, right here on the video, right? So I'm gonna go on and buy Braden's, I'm gonna buy Bernie's and Jody's, and I'm gonna give all three of these to you guys next week. Okay, completely free. So you show up next week, you're gonna get their their pages completely free. And you've learned a little bit about why some of these pages will work, why some of them I don't think will work, um, and how kind of 
how we can when you're designing how to design right now i also told you i was going to give you the start of phase two so phase two starts right here with the dmm sales page okay so tonight i am giving you this sales page now there's no opt-in page before it because this is activated by an email okay so what that means is it's somebody already on our list that's going to be shooting down to here to this sales page so i've built this sales page for you it's important that the things look like they belong together so what i did was i took the original page uh thank you page and i pulled that out and i made it very big i want you to look at how basic this is right now if you look at the actual page let me edit the page um there is a button here it's just timed right so we have timed by button all right and everything looks like this this is extremely basic but this is what works okay this is how you make sales because the only thing i can focus on on this page is this video there's nothing else for me to focus on there's nothing to take my attention away from that video which is what we want people to watch right i'm also giving you the video it's already loaded on the page so you don't have to do anything okay it's just it's already there you now will have this page to mail okay to any of the leads you get when you launch this funnel so now what you're able to do is check it out you have all these pages up here so you have opt-in page sales page you're going to send some emails you're going to try to get them to 24 hour they wait you're going to try to get them with a 48 hour reopen then you close it down you wait for three or four days and then boom you email to this okay you email to this one when you email to this one now we're taking a different approach we're saying hey hmm okay you weren't interested in uh the newsletter but maybe you'll be interested in this mastermind right and of course as we go through this you'll see that we're going to be able to give you the emails and the closing pages next week to literally be done with this funnel because now you'll be able to send people down a path the same path that they went down for this one okay for the newsletter they'll go down for the digital mastermind okay so it's the same path it's just a different offer we flipped the offer positions right and that means we get to flip the messaging flip the email messaging and we get to really dial it in to people that are more interested maybe in the mastermind opportunity than the newsletter right so it's a great opportunity for us to reach a different buyer somebody will say yes to something else right does that make sense to everybody yes so so basically tonight i'm going to give you access to that page okay next week let's do this because we're finished next week right next week is a big week because we're finished so next week Number one, I'm gonna give you the three pages bought from students for 24 hour and 48 hour closing. Okay, so I'm gonna give you the three that I told you I was gonna buy. I'm going to give you all emails for phase two of the affiliate selling system i'm also going to give you i'm going to give you my 24 and 48 hour digital marketing mastermind pages what that means is we launch your business next week we can launch your business because next week we're done next week I'm going to give you those last few assets here of this funnel right here everything not highlighted I'm going to give to you 
and then we're going to launch it and we're going to connect everything together and we're gonna be good to go which means next week i know a lot of you like to get on a little late because i ramble for 10 minutes to each their own if you don't want to hear my rambling or any of my messaging um and next week we're gonna start right on time like diving in because it'll take me a while to get through showing you how to launch it right so next week we launch next week you're going to get the student bought pages that i bought tonight you're going to get all the emails from phase two of the affiliate selling system you're going to get the 48 and the 24 hour uh pages for digital mastermind and you'll be ready to go like i can turn you loose you can start buying solo ads traffic use clickly traffic whatever you want to do you can start hammering this and generating sales how many of you are excited about that yes very cool let me show you how to get to this i know i'm running late i'm sorry i apologize i just i'm running late what can i say i don't have any excuses it just took me a little longer than i thought um this is your uh student resource center okay so in your student resource center it's very very top you will see where you can join our facebook group i really want you to join our facebook group it's free it's the best place for you to be it's where you can connect with everybody in the community you need to do this first and foremost tonight okay second thing is you should join me on youtube and follow me third thing is uh again uh much love to cc and her family uh if you are still interested in supporting cc's children's book i'm going to leave this here on the page for another week um in memory of cc and all the effort and all the time and all the energy she put in uh each and every week here on the success connection but also in her books uh to spread positive messaging to children around the world that my god if there's everything we need it's positive messaging right um so uh if you'd like to buy cc's books and and distribute those to some children um the link will be there okay for those of you that are new you will need click funnels in order to get this page and 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 all the pages i built it's inside of click funnels it's real simple you click here you activate your free trial cost you nothing it's completely free for two weeks you activate a free trial then you're able to go to any of these yellow lines represent businesses that we've built in click funnels for you when you click the download link it will automatically put those funnels into your click funnels account similar uh to this so similar to let's see um similar to this this is a whole funnel right here you would get this whole funnel right so all of these yellow lines represent businesses with all the assets you can download look at that okay you will want to scroll all the way down way down here to the affiliate selling system number two you want to download this funnel this funnel has the opt-in pages the student bought pages it also has your second uh phase two sales page the dmm sales page is right here in this funnel so you'll click this and download this tonight okay then you'll download your 48 hour and 24 hour reopen emails you can download the ebook right here and then you can activate your affiliate links by putting your email address into this box and clicking activate now you'll have your affiliate links you'll have an entire funnel you'll have everything you need to sell but of course you do have to make sure that you actually have okay click funnels in order to be able to uh in order to be able to actually download any of these so you will need click funnels um i did tell you guys february 1st was the last day that we were going to uh give you 100 percent commissions on this in other words uh you are promoting the m insider newsletter and the digital marketing mastermind right those are two offers i have um and i said if you own them before we launch it that i'll give you uh, 100% commissions. Well, the I don't. I was that was last week when I discussed this, and I was kind of off on my dates. It's February 3rd because it's tonight. So uh, tonight is the cutoff for that. So if you want 100% commissions on the M Insider newsletter and the Digital Marketing Mastermind, uh, you will need to own those two products by tonight. Okay, you can get that from logging into. Uh, the Student Resource Center, uh, your, basically your Morrison Education Center, and clicking on those products. Actually, the Digital Mastermind one's right here. Uh, the newsletter one is not anywhere on here. You'll have to, uh, you'll have to actually go um, into our Student Center to get that, right? Um, which is fine. You can do that. But if you purchase those tonight, you will get 100% commissions when and if you make sales through the funnel that we, we have here. Uh, the cutoff will be tonight. Everybody at the end, of, basically in the morning, my developers will go in and change everybody that has it to 100% commissions on it. 
and that's it. And then going forward, it'll just be 50%, right? Or 40 or whatever we normally pay, okay? So just wanna be clear on that. Tonight is the cutoff. Uh, tonight will be the end of 100% commissions on these two products, right? Okay, so you have everything that you need. You just need to know how to get to this page. And when you get to this page, you can download all these things. Here's the thing, all these download links quit working tonight at midnight, okay? So tonight at midnight, they stop working. So what you need to do is make sure you do this stuff now. Come in here, join the Facebook group, you know, make sure that you have click funnels and download your funnels tonight, or else you're gonna get left behind because they won't be open again until next Thursday. That is so people will not steal my stuff, not because I'm a mean human. It's because people steal my stuff, so I had to start locking it down. How do you get to this page? You go right here, go.dsc.com forward slash funnel, and you put in the password wealth, okay? So go.dsc.com forward slash funnel, and you put in the password wealth. And when you do that, it will take you right here to this page, to the Success Connection Student Resource Center, where you can join our Facebook group. You can join me here on YouTube. You can support Cece and her ability to share her story, even though she is not with us anymore, share her knowledge uh, to so many people around the world. So if, uh, if your heart desires, do that. And then of course, uh, you can activate your free trial to ClickFunnels. This is free. If you don't have ClickFunnels, you need to get it. You need to get it right now so that you can go down here and download all these funnels. Most importantly, scrolling all the way down to the affiliate selling system number two and downloading this funnel right here so that you get these pages. And then of course, making sure that you download the emails, the ebook, and then uh, activating your affiliate links. And of course, if you want 100% commissions, make a sale, get 100% of it, um, make sure that you own my M Insider newsletter and make sure that you own uh, my digital mastermind, digital marketing mastermind uh, by tonight. If you own it by the end of tonight, you will be upgraded in the morning to 100% commissions, okay? So all of that is available right here, again, in your student resource center. All you've got to do is go to the link, go.dsc.com forward slash funnel, type in the password wealth, and that will take you there. Listen, guys, I want to thank you for being here. Thank you for joining me. I know I went a few minutes over. I always try my best to keep right on track, but remember next week, I'm going to be giving you three student bought pages that I bought tonight. I'm going to give you all the emails for phase two, the 24 and 48 hour pages for phase two, and we are going to launch the entire affiliate selling system number two next week live on the Success Connection. Make sure you are here. Do not miss it. It will be a lot of fun, but a lot of people will start making sales, and I want that to be you. And the only way it'll happen is if you're here and you're committed. Listen, have a great weekend. Have a safe weekend. Do a little something this weekend that other people aren't doing. That's what's going to keep you ahead of the game, and that's the name of the game, especially when it comes to internet marketing. Thank you guys so much for spending another hour with me. I look forward to seeing you all right here, same place, same time, next week on the Success Connection. Take care, everybody. Good night.